Shalom, and you're now locked in here. It's like Talk TV, where you get nothing but the raw and the real whenever I'm in front of the camera. So make sure y'all show the page some love, like, subscribe, and share. Shalom, greetings. Welcome back to another episode here at Is It Like Talk TV, one of the number one platforms where what? That's right, where y'all don't get no paid media. Now, family, I had to come back to you guys with some breaking news, right? Before I get into this, make sure y'all hit the like button, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel, and make sure y'all share this video, expedite this to the people, right? Now, family, check this out right here. I just did a live this morning, right? Just go check the credits, right? I just did a live this morning talking about this takeoff stuff, right? Well, look at here. Jaguar Wright just did an interview on Street Stars. I'm watching it right now, right? Now, I'm going to clip out a piece, right? I want you guys to listen to it. Two things that Jaguar Wright is confirming, right? The first thing she confirmed that the Delta takeoff was an industry hit. As I just told y'all, right? And everybody else been saying that's in that same vein, right? The other thing is, because you could tell how Quavo moving. You see what I'm saying? The other thing is this, family. She spoke about that Pimp C thing, man. Man, listen. Listen to what that woman said. And, uh, listen, I'm, listen to what she said, and then I'm going to come back with some commentary on my own. All right, let's run it. So, so corporate takeoff's death was a nothing but a corporate hostile takeover using his life as the god. Oh, my God. Man, R.I.P. takeoff. That boy died so they could cash in a motherfucking insurance policy and to cover up the fact that Rock Nation was ripping Megan away from 300. I guess nobody's paying attention to the fact that complete control of Megan the Stallion's career was taken over right after Takeoff died and the Prince family were forced to leverage and let her go, even though they did not want to. Mm. Well, that interesting. Houston politics. <laughs> Let me ask you because uh And I'm not saying allegedly. Oh. Okay, okay. Okay, well, yeah. I'm saying Sean Carter, you're a piece of shit. Taking Pimp C wasn't bad enough. You just wanna go down there and you wanna just remove all of the balls from every real gangster in Houston. So listen, family, did y'all hear what Jaguar Wright just said? She said, this is not no allegedly. This ain't no allegedly. This also, now family, now listen to this right here. This makes sense even in the Tory Lane case, man. See, here's the deal, right? It's a lot of shady shit that's going on in that, in the, in that, in that industry that everybody wants to be part of. But she just told you, now didn't I tell you, go check the credits. I, the videos are in the archives. Go check the video out on the sex tape on Pimp C and then the death of Pimp C. See, this is why I explained to you guys. There was a lot of shit that was going on in regards to Pimp C, right? He had that beef with Jay Prince. And then, of course, it was beef about that tape, that sex tape. Now, everybody went around here playing games and, oh, man, this and that. But that woman just said, y'all heard what that woman just said. She said, oh, Pimp C wasn't enough. This is why when that hit came down on Pimp C, this is why it got done. Because if y'all remember, Pimp and Ken told y'all that him and Jay Prince was protecting Pimp C. You know what I'm saying? So in order for something like that to happen to Pimp C, it had to be agreed upon like, hey, okay, wooty wooty woo. And y'all got to understand that Pimp C had smoke with... Well, I ain't going to say he had smoke with Jay-Z. Of course, we know he didn't like Jay-Z, but because of that tape, that tape was floating around and people knew that tape was around. And then, like Holmes said, when Pimp C got out the joint, him and Jay Prince had smoke. That's why the green light was given. This is what y'all got to understand. Man, this shit is getting crazy. Y'all leave y'all thoughts below. Let me know what y'all think about this. And we might talk about this tomorrow, man, because Jaguar Wright ain't playing, man. You heard what she said. This ain't no allegedly. Man, I'm signing off film is it like talk TV. Shalom.